picked off by Kiko Alonso. And what a return as he brings this all the way back down to the 20 yard line. Kelsey, the intended receiver there. Well, that's a drive killer right there. Not a really confident throw either. This one was kind of up for grabs, and it's going to come down to hands of the wrong team. First foray into the red zone for Miami. First and 10 right at the 20. 50, 50. Here's the first carry for Kenyon Drake. And able to push his way forward here for a good little game. It's a pickup of four, and it'll bring up second down. On any running play that's called, they're always hoping that it's going to break big and go the distance. But when you get a nice game like that, you're able to do so many things anyway. You can come back and run essentially the same play again, continue to move the ball on the ground, or you can decide to throw the ball now because usually you have the defense back on its heels. They'll lose a yard, and it brings up third. I know when I was a kid, I always got real excited when I saw those lateral-type runs. But the best backs that made it happen, they put a foot in the ground and just go. That didn't happen there. That play got swallowed up. On third down, Drake. And he'll take this into the end zone for a Dolphins touchdown. Kenyon Drake, an 18-yard touchdown run. And the Dolphins are going to take a first-quarter lead. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And it's now a 7-0 game. Out is the kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. Now the Chiefs offense, they get ready to head on the field. Mahomes will lead the Chiefs up first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Try to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. The Dolphins get there this time, and they bring him down. Charles Harris in there to bury him for a loss of 11. Great job defensively. I think he was trying to go through his progressions, find someone to get rid of the football. Before he knew it, he was on his back. So that just brings us right back to what you said in the beginning. A great job defensively. Nowhere to go with the football. That led to the sack. Now they're in some hot water now. After that sack, it's second and 21. Play fake there to Hunt. Now Mahomes. And he goes down. It's a sack. They get him back at his own three-yard line. Well, if an offense is going to throw the ball in this part of the field, any pass rusher will tell you that's his favorite part. Gets a chance to get after the quarterback. It's almost like a reverse red zone. They can create points using their defense, and this time they take their man down. Need something from deep in the bag of tricks here after first and second down went backwards. It's third and very long. Working from the gun, Mahomes. He's going to look deep down the field. And it's knocked away and incomplete. The safety, T.J. McDonald, getting in there to break that one up. But well, we quit counting yardage on that one, didn't we? That was truly third and a mile, wasn't it? It was. I thought they might just go underneath, but they didn't. They wanted to get the first down there. Yeah, they tried to pick up the huge chunk unsuccessfully. I'm with you.
would have tried to take some yardage just to gain some field position. Here's Dustin Colquitt now. And no room for air here as his first punt comes from deep in his own end zone. So a short drop, but he's able to get it out, and this is a good kick. Take it at the 37. 12 yards on the return that time, and it'll be Dolphin football. The Dolphins offense now working their way back onto the field. Now they'll be looking to duplicate the efforts of drive number one that resulted in seven points in the seven-zip lead. Well, you know how much I enjoy horse racing, right? Looks like they caught a flyer out of the gate, as they would say when you're running the big-time races. Means they get out to a fast start. They're setting the pace. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. You never want to give up a sack. From the O-line's perspective, they hate it for several reasons, especially because they felt like they let little brother down back there in the pocket. Oh, no doubt. They have a ton of pride, and they go into every job wanting to keep that guy clean. They want that uniform with no grass stains, no dirt, nothing on it, but it's really, really difficult. You're talking about some terrific athletes who are trying to put him on the ground. On second down, it's Drake. And he'll take this up over the 40 to about the 41. The pass rush specialist, D. Ford, in on the stop. Well, they had that one sniffed out. Excellent run blitz. Stopped that one for a short gain. What makes a good run blitz a good run blitz? The ability to stay on task, to follow up your assignment, go to the gap you're supposed to cover, and not be deterred by anything else. It's Tannehill. Got a man open. That's Devontae Parker complete. And he'll get it down to the 47 here. It'll be a gain of 12, but it will also lead to fourth down. Well, as this game continues to evolve in the NFL, you know how much coaches love run after catch, but you know what they love even more? Completion. Yeah, just holding on to the ball. Catch it, cover it, tuck it away. Whatever you get after that is almost gravy. That's how a lot of these receivers are being taught now. And no move to get the offense off the field. They're going on fourth and five. The They'll run it now out of the gun. And he won't get there. They stop him a few yards short of the line to gain. Back now with Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon as the Chiefs in possession of the football as we begin the second quarter. And they've got it here with a first down. The fourth down run successful. Hey, 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 now they look hey, to pay hey. it off on first down. Left, 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 left. Slow, slow, slow. On first and ten, here's Mahomes. And the Dolphins rush gets home. Down he goes. Kiko Alonso in there to bring him down for a loss of seven. Sacks, a growing theme in this first half. This is second and long. Left, 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 left. Shotgun snap to Mahomes. Over the middle, complete. That's Hunt. And that he's going to get this down to the 35-yard line. A very solid gain of 27. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers' tight ends because their ability to make people into a double team and it's intercepted. Picked up by the linebacker Raquan McMillan. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. And Brandon, this is a real nice job defensively of getting inside a quarterback's head and figuring out, okay. Where is he going with the football? Because you can make an educated guess defensively. Not all the time, but sometimes. And when you're right, you've got a decent chance of coming away with the football. And he's able to get this one all the way past the 30. That good for 22 and a first down. Outside handoff to the right side. 
If you're a running back, you love getting the ball early so you have vision to see what's happening in front of you. Right tackle likes that call. Big play for him, but don't forget about the guys you always tell me on the backside ceiling off. When they talk about cutoff blocks, making sure no one can leak from the backside that can run a play down. Yeah, nobody leaked. Big play. Just a yard on the pickup there, and it'll bring up a second and nine. Now that's the type of play that will fire up a defense, hold them to one yard on a first down run. It'll be interesting to see if the offense decides to press the run at all or if they'll abandon it now after gaining only one on that play. Now on second down, this is Gore. And the hole closes quickly. He gets it across the 35 to the 36-yard line. He only got a couple on that one, so not a ton of help. They'll have a third and eight forthcoming. Tannehill hands to Bray, and he'll get up to the 43-yard line. It'll be a gain of seven, but I'd imagine we'll see the punt team here on fourth down. Despite the blitz, they're still able to pick up a nice, solid gain. The disadvantage of blitzing often alters the normal spacing and run fits and leaves creases like they were able to exploit right there. Now the offense failed earlier on the previous crack at this, but they're going again on fourth down. It's a... Pitch out to Drake. Oh, and I think he went backward. He did. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out. And the Chiefs will have the football back in excellent field position. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. Try to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. Throwing the out route incomplete. That's Hill. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. A good pick up there of 20 yards. Never make the mistake that the slot receivers, especially the little guys like we're watching here, are just quicker than fast. A lot of them combine quickness and speed, and they catch a lot of footballs as we just saw there. Two minutes to go here in the first half. We'll come back to Miami after this. On first down, Mahomes. They'll go screen here to Hunt. And on this one, he'll get to the 15, right at the 15-yard line. Seven yards there on the first down screen play. For a second there, I thought that might break big. Screen pass. Looked like it was coming together. Looked like there was an opening. Still ended up with a solid game. Mahomes to throw on second down. Caught here by Conley. And they'll lose yardage here. Knocked back to the 19-yard line. He lost four there, and it's third down. From the gun on third down, Mahomes. He can run for it, and he will. Only able to get back a yard for his efforts, and that leads us to fourth down. Well, partner, nothing comes open here, so he decides to escape out.